from his demeanor, I'd say it's too late. He's a lit fuse on a human powder keg. I'd like to be around when he goes through. Are we island kiss for you? Get back up! Mr. Carto, are you here? Anyone home? Right, well, what happened here? A key hidden behind a spectral web. Why? Despite the barley shortage, Lucy Barrow was brewing ale. Drove Perry mad. Sent him snipping after her. That, Mr. Cottle, is not the way. Now what else are you guilty of? Do not touch that, you filthy thief! You! Who are you? What are you doing here? Wait! The Banisher McGraith! Haunted by a ghost? You must be joking! Good day. I'm Antea Duarte. Lucy Barrow, I presume? You presume right. But never mind that. Perry Cottle stole the key to my alehouse. You have it. I want it back. Why would Perry Cottle have the key to your alehouse? He wishes to steal my business, so I hid it from him. There's nothing quite like watching a grown man soil his britches over losing a bloody key. Serves him right. The barley failed. 
No barley means no flour. No flour means no bread. It drove him mad. It made him mean. I don't easily scare, but he scared me. And I was right. In the end, he poisoned me. Tell me about the poisoning. To start, let me tell you about the Baker Perry Cottle, who is as mean as he is stupid. Mean, for he would not pay me for my work. Stupid, for he poisoned me before he could get his grubby hands on it. Are you sure he poisoned you? We had words. He threatened me. He carried out the threat. It seems cut and dried to me. You know how to brew ale without barley. You know this because Perry Cottle spied you doing it. For a great baker, he makes a piss-weak spy. Why would you not share your work? I'll tell you this. My husband and I ran a tavern in England. He supported my ambition. Never once was he intimidated by me. When he died, I sold up and left for the new world. I was looking for peace, opportunity, wealth. I found it all. Until the curse. Everything I have, I earned with the sweat of my brow and the brains in my head, and neither man nor God shall take it from me. Perry Cottle thinks innovation, the fruit of my labor, comes from God to be shared by all, but especially by Perry Cottle. I am a woman of enterprise, and no one drinks for free. No payment, no deal. You don't believe me? See for yourself. You have the key. Go to the alehouse where I died. Where is it? Go north, across the bridge, past the fallow fields. But do be careful. I hear it's haunted by the ghost of the poor dead alewife. We should go. Can't get a moment's peace, can you? Even dead, there's work to be done. Looks like Perry Cottle left some details out of his story. Let's go to the alehouse. I was thought I'd be angry too. He says one thing, she says the other. Not to know for sure who's lying. A vengeful ghost is always dangerous. I should know. <laughs> <laughs> 